Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, then welcome. Happy to have you. Uh, today I'm doing a combo like I often do. It's an unboxing and a haul video. So I'm going to show you some items that I got at Goodwill. But I think first let's do an unboxing. Uh, I have two items here from some really awesome resellers. Um, let me get this open really quick. This first one is going to be from Leanne, Crafty Kitty Vintage. So she sent me a little box. So let me see what I got. I can't remember what I ordered from her. That's how it usually goes. Um, so if you're new to my channel, uh, just let you know that I do haul videos like I'm doing today. Uh, sometimes I do little craft videos. I haven't done one in a while, but I may start doing it again. I have live sales twice a week. I have one, um, I have sales on Thursdays at four o'clock Eastern. And I also have them Sunday night at nine o'clock Eastern with the Chatty Kitties. And Leanne from Crafty Kitty Vintage and Sabrina from Simon Says Let's Make a Deal. Um, they're both part of the Crafty Kitties, or the Chatty Kitties, I should say, <laughs> the Chatty Kitties, uh, every Sunday night, and we do rotate on channels. This Sunday, it's going to be on Sabrina's channel, uh, Sabrina from Simon Says Let's Make a Deal. And this Thursday, um, is I'm going to have Tiger from Tiger's Timeless Treasures. He's another Zony from Arizona, and he's going to be joining me on Thursday, so that's going to be a lot of fun. Okay, this first item, oh, I have a feeling this is a gift for my granddaughter from Leanne. She was asking me if my granddaughter still collected uh, Paris items, like Eiffel Towers, so she'll be really happy to get that. Thank you, Leanne. She's so thoughtful, very thoughtful. Now, let's see what else. Oh, I think, can I say, do I remember what I got? No, I don't remember what I got. Oh, this was um, gifted to me from Sabrina from Simon Says Let's Make a Deal. We were doing a sale together, and Leanne has some um, little uh, Wade Wimsies. And this was in a lot that Sabrina purchased. And Sabrina says she already had this one, so she said to gift it to me. I'm so excited. Oh, I love this one. I've been wanting this one for a long time. So thank you, Sabrina, for that. And let's see what else. Um, oh, there's a little card in here. I guess I probably should have opened that first. Oh, it's a little Valentine card. Aw, let me see. Pounds for pounds, you're terrific. Valentine's Day was yesterday. I actually did get this before Valentine's Day. Oh, and she has little, oh, there's two little blank ones. How cute. Oh, and with two little envelopes. It's a little greeting card I can use for my, my, uh, not greeting card. It's a playing card. <laughs> I've never seen one like this. It's the same on both sides. Isn't that interesting? But I can use that for my junk journaling. She gave me another little heart. And this says thank you. What is this? <gasps> I hope it's what I think it is. <gasps> it is. Oh my gosh. She just started um, selling these. Oh my God. I'm so happy she gave me one. Look at it. Now she'll be selling these. It's her merch. Isn't that adorable? It's a little kitty cat. So yeah, check her out. Um, she'll probably be selling them too on on the channel or the sales we do together. How fun. This is a lot of stuff in here. Oh, it's a pie bird. That's what I got from her, a pie bird. I couldn't remember. <laughs> um, Cause this was, I have a black one and this is a white one. I've never seen the white ones before. So isn't this cute? Now I just use this for decor. I don't actually use it um, for baking pies. But this will go with my little blackbird. Oh, thank you so much. Happy to get that. Add to my collection. And then she's got another something in here. What is this? Oh, this is from um, Patrick. Another item that she was, um, she was selling. And he said to go ahead and 
son one to me, which is very sweet. So thank you, Patrick. She wrapped this up so nice. That's another little heart. And I can't remember this stone, but it's a little stone heart. Isn't that pretty? So thank you to Patrick for that. It's so fun getting gifts. <laughs> yeah, people are so nice. Nice people in this community, they really are. And then my next item is from Pat Padoodles. Um, and Pat, we had a doll sale together and I need to get with her so we can have another sale together. Um, but she does a lot of, she does a lot of variety of things. Pat can do anything. She's so talented. And um, she was selling some lace. So I thought I would get some for my, um, my journals that I've been doing. One of these days I will show you, I'll do a show and tell, show you um, some of the journals that I'm working on. I just started this, uh, when was it? Probably just before Halloween, maybe. It hasn't been that long. Um, I've been seeing other people do them and I thought, you know, I wanna really do that. I love them. I love getting them and uh, I thought I'd do one myself. So let's see. What kind of lace? Uh, I should have gotten more of this, really. Um, but look at how beautiful that is. So yeah, these are nice for like journal covers. I mean, it could be used for a lot of things. I could use it for doll clothes. You could use this, I could use this for my Cupid dolls. Um, but we'll see, I'll probably use, uh, there's a lot here, a lot more than I thought. Boy, I forget how, how big a yard is. <laughs> so I got a lot of that and this was good deals. And Pat has a lot of sales on her channel, Pat Doodles. And I'll put everybody's link down below. Um, I got some nice pink lace, really pretty. And some blue lace. Like I said, I caught the, I wish I would have caught her sale live because I would have bought a lot more. Um, but I just saw it on the replay. But that's one nice thing about YouTube is once the, the live sale is done, you can always go back to the replay and if the items are still available, you can still get them. Some beautiful blue lace. So thank you, Pat. That will be put to good use. Definitely, I love lace. Okay, so now on to Goodwill. So this is, um, I went yesterday, Tuesday. Um, it was Senior Tuesday, we get 25% off. Oh, and I also went to uh, Sunshine Acres Children's Thrift. They were 40% off. So you know what, I'm gonna show you, I'll show you first what I got at Sunshine Acres. I hope I have it all here. I think I do. Some of their prices was very high. Now I got two Fenton items. They wanted a lot for this. I could not have bought it if it wasn't 40% off because it was ridiculous. It was the price that I would have sold it for. Let's just put it that way. But I got this beautiful um, hobnail bowl. It needs to be clean. It's really filthy dirty, um, but it's really pretty. And I've never seen one with these little um, dividers here, or these little like rope. But it's very pretty, very good condition. So I got that and I got another um, Fenton. This is a smaller piece. I just sold a covered dish that was very similar to this. It was a little bit larger. But I love that scalloped edge. So I picked that up. I got another one of these Avon pictures. I love these. And if I see them for a decent price, and at 40% off, it was a decent price. The regular price, not so decent. <laughs> but um, being that it was 40% off, it was good. And the stopper, I had to kind of fool around with the stopper. It was all messed up, but it now it fits nice and snug in there. Um, Got to be careful, but yeah, I think it's pretty, pretty snug. And I love these, so that will be for sale. So will the Fenton. The Fenton will also be for sale. I also picked up this little cruet, and I don't know who the maker is, but um, I thought it was really nice. I love milk glass. It goes with anything, and I love the texture on here. So it's just a really, really cute little cruet that just looks nice in a display too a lot of things that are pretty and fancy i use it as display 
Um, I got this. I'm not really sure what this is, but I thought it would be nice for bracelets. You could hang your bracelets here. I don't have any to show you. Um, but I thought maybe that be a nice use for it. I love this uh, style. Um, I don't know what you call it, but it's... Uh, I know we have some things like this back in the 60s and 70s. So, but that is really cute to hang your bracelets on, I thought. And then, oh, I got these two really cute little kitties. They're not vintage, but I thought they were just adorable. And you know, I love cats. So I did pick these up and they're little card holders. Aren't they cute? And then, let's see what else did I get there. Oh, I got these, um, little candle holders. They're brass. I always pick up brass. Um, it was at a good price. And again, at 40% off, it was decent. Um, so there's three different sizes of this. Now I've had just this part for the votive. I'd never seen them on stands before. Um, I believe these were made in India and they are three different sizes. And I thought they were really cool. So, of course, I had to pick those up. And they did come with these little um, tea lights, and I don't know if they work. Let's see if they work. Oops. Um, yeah, so I'll probably sell them with those little tea lights. Okay, and then... Let's see, I think I have one more item that I got from there. And that was the, now again, these are not vintage. Matter of fact, these are Pioneer Woman. I got two more items. Um, Pioneer Woman salt and pepper shakers. But these sell for quite a bit. I think they were like, um, like $18 new. Maybe more, I'm not sure. But I just love these. They are so pretty. And they have their stoppers, they're in excellent condition. And then the last thing I got there was this um, Yankee Candle Alumalid. Now they say on the back that this is supposed to make the candle burn better. I don't know if it does or not, but it is pretty. I was gonna use this for a jar that I have. Um, but it's too small. It's just a little bit too small. It's just like a little powder dish I have that's missing the lid. Um, but anyway, so it's kind of heavy. I don't know if it's pewter or it's pewter-like. Some type of metal. Okay, now Goodwill. I didn't get a lot of Goodwill. Um, I picked up this tin. Pretty little angel tin. I love tins. Um, if they're nice, I will get them. This doesn't have any markings on it, so I don't know who makes it. But this is always nice to, um, when I'm doing my sales, to add some little goodies in there and then just sell it as a lot. And I may, may do that with this one too. Sometimes I sell them individually, but we'll see. There's a beautiful angel on there. Um, I picked up this plate. I usually don't pick these up, but I thought this one was really nice. Um, I could see this in a cabin or in a rustic house. Um, I just love the scene on here. The nice cozy fireplace. It does have a hanger at the back. There's no, there's some little teeny tiny hole. A little tiny hole right there. You can see it through the light. But yeah, so I did pick that up. It has like a, a fireplace. It has a, a spinning wheel, a clock on the mantle, it's got a gun and some kind of a horn. So, yeah. this I got, it's not vintage, but it's, it's different and it's hand painted. I love anything mm -hmm. artistic. And unfortunately the person didn't sign this. It's like, why didn't you not sign your work? But it's just a glass mm -hmm. carafe that somebody painted. And it's a little um, Halloween scene. And I just love this. 
I love it. Isn't it just adorable? So, yeah, I really like that. I love that it's hand painted. Oh, wait a minute. Nope, no signature. I can see maybe there is a signature. Nope, there is not. And the way they painted this, well, no, maybe not. Never mind. But yeah, I just love it. I just think it's really cool. I thought that was silver paint, but I think it's just um, where the you see the glass through. It almost looks silver. But I love that. So yeah, I had to get it. Um, and then I got this turtle, and I think I, I think I sold one like this, uh, very similar. But mine had a slot for a bank. This is a hobbyist piece. But I love it. Who doesn't who doesn't like turtles, right? And this one, um, it is signed on the bottom. Well, the initials ML91. So yeah, it's really nice. There's a little, a little teeny tiny chip right here in the paint, but very, very minimal really cute and then um so i didn't get much there what else did i get oh i just got this little jar it's i don't know if this is flashed on but i love the shape of it and i love the color so this will probably go with my collection of glass that i have on my windowsill <laughs> i really need it but i like the size um it fits with my other items and then I got this copper, because I love copper, a copper vase. It has a little brass ring around there. Um, it's really nice, nice, heavy piece of copper. Um, so yeah, I had to get that. It does have a little dent right there and here, but it's very minimal. And it does not take away from the beauty of this item. I like the patina on there. It does need some cleaning because I have their sticker residue. But other than that, I just, I probably will keep that patina on there because that just shows its age. And then, uh, is that it? Oh, and then I just went over to Ross Senior, again, Senior Tuesday, 10% off. And look at this cute, adorable mug. It says Frenchie Kisses. So I bought this and I haven't decided if I'm going to sell this or keep it. Now this does not go in the microwave, um, and I'm not sure about the dishwasher. Oh, hand wash only, do not microwave. It's by Fig and Fern. Um, it has a little bit of gold on there. That's probably why you can't put it in the microwave. But I just thought that was adorable. And look at the size. I mean, it's a really good size mug. It has some weight to it, um, and it's just adorable. So I don't know if I'm gonna keep it or sell it. And I like that it has the Frenchies on both sides. And I love Frenchie dogs. They're the cutest. <laughs> um, and is that it? And then I, I bought myself a couple pairs of jeans. Uh, one pair I have to return, one fits good. And I'm looking around to see if I'm missing anything. I think that was it. That was everything. So please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. I'm almost to 700. I think I need 20 more. So if you could subscribe, I'd greatly appreciate it. I'm really trying to build up my channel. My goal is eventually to get to 1,000. But right now, um, I'll be happy at 700. <laughs> so I just need 20 more. Um, and then don't forget to go and watch uh, tomorrow, which is Thursday at 4 o'clock Eastern. I'll be on with Tiger from Tiger's Timeless Treasures, and he always has nice things at really good prices. So please come and watch us, and uh, maybe you'll find something you want. You don't have to buy anything. You can come and just say hello. That would be nice, too. So uh, thank you for watching, and until next time. Oh, I forgot one more thing. Uh, February 19th, which is, which is a Sunday. I think it's this coming Sunday. Um, besides being on the Chatty Kitties Sunday night, I'm also having a drop sale, which means I have a pre-recorded sale that I'm, I'm going to try to get it recorded today or tomorrow. And um, 
that's with like 15 other resellers. So every half hour, there will be another reseller. I'm going to be on at 3.30 Eastern. I believe it starts at, I think, 3 o'clock Eastern, I think, is when the sale starts. It's um, hosted by um, Patrick from Trusty Huckster Mercantile and Beth from uh, Carolina Sweet Treats and Pretties. Say Carolina, oh, Carolina Princess, Sweet Trees and Pretties. Um, and there's a lot of people. I mean, Tiger is going to be there and there. Vintage and Vino, some other Zonies. Um, Mimi's Treasure Cottage. I think D from Thrill of the Thrift. Vintage Vinny. Um, Nancy from this old, the old stuff, this old stuffed house. This stuffed. I can't remember. Sorry. Um, there's quite a few people. It's going to be fun. So I hope you'll come and join us for that. So until next time, I'll see you in the chats. Bye.